Wow, here it is. Eligard's Redstone Laboratory. Seems more like an entrance or a foyer or something. Oh, don't oh. worry, pal, we'll find her. I just hope she can actually help us. Redstone stuff I've ever seen in my life. You can say that again. Come on, let's keep moving. God, what are those things even for? Maybe, I don't know, breaking things up, keeping intruders out. There are lots of possibilities. Looks like I can adjust the settings on this thing. Okay, almost. Definitely a step in the right direction. Yeah. Nicely done, Jesse. You're pretty good at this. Hey, what can I say? Me and the Redstone just speak to each other. Uh huh. She's moving a lot of different ingredients around here. Man, look at all this, huh? Whatever she's working on, if it requires all of these ingredients. Now, I don't want to alarm you, Olivia, but I have no idea what I'm looking at here. I don't know what it is yet either. That's why I'm studying it. Come on, let's keep moving. buddy. This close to meeting Eligard. Getting excited? Like you wouldn't believe. I wonder what she'll really be like in person. Hmm. I dreamt it. Entering Eligard's laboratory, seeing her right there. She'll ask me to be her apprentice, and the next thing you know, we'll be changing the world together. Let's just try to save the world first. Time to pace back and forth and check the systems. Inventory request. Operational. Delivery latency? Speedy. Still talking to myself? Yep. Whoa. Hi. Hey. Didn't see you sneaking up on me. <laughs> Guess that's the point. Don't touch anything in here, okay? It's all supremely fragile and genius. Did Calvin send you? You my new assistants? New assistants with a stupidly adorable pig, that is. 
Eligard. No time for specifics, I'm afraid. Hey, you! Goggle Girl. Switch on that T-flop circuit to activate the delivery chutes. And you, non-goggle guy? Grab me a blaze rod and an iron block. She wants me to do something for her. What if I screw it up? What if I... Oh, I feel lightheaded. Wow, now I need an assistant to help with my assistant. Think you can handle it on your own? Olivia? O Olivia, can you hear me? I don't think that I've ever fainted before. Ugh, so embarrassing. Everything working over... Ooh. Hmm. Fine, I I'll just do it myself then. Six thousand four hundred fifty-one. Another bust. Now, about you three. Uh, your friend here. Does she fall over frequently? Is this going to be a regular occurrence? I. No. I'm sorry. I was just so excited to. And with me always pacing around, lost in my own brilliant thoughts, I could have tripped over you and conked my brain. Eligard, we've actually got much bigger problems to deal with. We're actually here to get your help. There's a giant wither storm, and it's attacking the entire world. A wither what? What are you talking about? Who, who sent you? Was it Calvin? Gabriel sent me. Look, you both seem like very pleasant people who are prone to fainting, but I simply don't have the brain power for this. I'm in the middle of my greatest project to date. A powerful block capable of altering reality itself. I'm so close, I can practically taste it. And it tastes like victory. I've seen one of those before. It's a command block. Wait, 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 wait. How do you know what a command block is? Not to seem belittling, but we are talking about some mega, ultra-genius level stuff here. It's very, very dangerous. The world needs the Order of the Stone. That's why we're here. Ugh, sorry to bust your circuits, but the Order isn't really together anymore. We, uh, sort of disassembled. That's actually kind of why we're here. Gabriel's amulet. This certainly changes things. Haven't seen one of these in a long time. So do you believe us now? Yes. This is serious indeed. All the more reason why I need to finish my command block. I can use it to fight this Witherstorm monster thing, or whatever. Necessity is the originator of invention. And that monster is my necessity for inventing, of which I am the originator. Is that even possible? Can you really do that? This is the Eligard you're talking to, who is me, if you're confused. And I, Eligard, will make a command block today. Your Witherstorm problem was created by a command block, yes? That means a command block could be the perfect way of beating it. And maybe Will you help me make one. It's going to work this time. I can feel it. Right here, in my brain. Eligard, I'm sorry, but no, I can't let you do this. Please, we have to go. Go? This seems terribly short-sighted. I had thought you were the brains of your little trio. This could be the greatest invention the world has ever seen. It could change everything. You'll understand when you see it, I promise. There's no time. While I'm very glad you want my assistance, and trust me, I won't faint, I'm still not sure why. Oh, my circuits. You were telling the truth. I'm beginning to feel we should get to the portal. Now, as soon as possible. <laughs>